Hello guys, for I got here. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, yeah, I'm playing Bloons Tower Defense Five again, and uh, okay. So, um, I'll be showing you guys all the upgrades of the glue gunner. Wait, just a second. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, okay, so, yeah, I'll be showing you guys all the upgrades of the glue gunner. So, you can place him down, and then, basically what he does is he just shoots the other balloons with glue, and then they slow down for a while. And there's a bunch of different upgrades, like glue soak. This one's actually really useful. Yeah. What it does is that so you can shoot him, and then as you can see, it soaks into the red balloon inside of it too. See? I know that went pretty fast, but yeah. And then corrosive glue is where it can eat at the balloons, like it kills them every few seconds. And then this one makes the glue effect last much longer. This one can like splatter six balloons at a time. I'll show you what I mean. As you can see, it's kind of like a glue explosion. And then the corrosiveness will kill them off. It's actually pretty good for like killing them. And then this path is mainly like the corrosiveness and like killing the balloons. This is just like slowing them down and gluing them. So yeah. On this side, there's a blue dissolver, which makes it, which makes the balloons pop twice every second. So I'll do that, and then, as you can see, they die pretty quickly. And it also has a glue explosion type thing. Oops. As you can see, missed a couple of them because it shoots pretty slow. But then this one is absolutely amazing. It dissolves them t ten times a second. Watch. Look at that. It's like instantly a kill. Oh, you just missed a bunch. Okay, so lead balloon, dead. Dead. Zebra balloon, dead. A couple zebra balloons dead. A bunch of rainbow balloons dead. A bunch of ceramic balloons dead. I'll show you guys that again. Look how epic this guy is. Not just for slowing them down, but for killing them. He might be better than a super monkey. <laughs> but there is a downfall. He cannot shoot at the Moab class balloons. So yeah, just a fair warning. Don't only use him. Because he won't be able to kill any of the blimps. Whatever you want to call him. Okay, so. Yeah, this is a really epic upgrade path. As you can easily tell. Look at that. There's like a whole crap ton of ceramic balloons. And they die before they even go into the first tunnel. Well, some of them take a little bit longer, but you guys see what I mean. And then... Okay. And then the other upgrade path, as I said, is mainly for slowing them down. Focusing on gluing all of them. And it comes with a glue striker ability, which glues all the guys on the screen. So... This is what I'll do. I'll just call in a crap ton of people and then place one and then boom they're all glued and it still has a corrosiveness too pretty cool and then Do, 
do do. This gets really annoying. Okay. So, um, where was I? Oh yeah. So, this upgrade path. Um, okay. So, this upgrade path makes it shoot three times as fast and then it glues everyone so I'll just show you how fast you can glue guys and it also has that glue explosion thing I was talking about earlier so he doesn't even need to turn it's just how epic he is and then there still is the corrosiveness too as you can see which makes it really good cause like yeah but still they cannot shoot any of the moab class ones it'd be like the moab the bfb and the zomg or whatever you call it but yeah guys that was upgrade paths paths <laughs> of the glue gunner monkey thing. Glue gunner, yeah. So yeah, I personally really like the glue gunner. I use him every single round. Mainly because of his slowness ability. But every once in a while I'll put him at the end of a level with the liquefier thing. So it kills him really fast before they exit. And so yeah, be sure to leave in the comments what one you like better. And if you were surprised by the ability of him. And stuff. Because honestly, I think it's probably the most amazing thing ever. But also, if you have two of them, and they're both different, this guy won't shoot if that guy did. I'm pretty sure it goes the other way around too. Uh, just a second... And as you can see, he doesn't even really get a chance to. But yeah, guys, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. That's about it. Goodbye.